Hi, I'm David. I'm the lead designer of Carbon Electra and I want to make a lead sound here demonstrating the use of four oscillators, uh, the modulation envelope, some effects and the step envelope. So by default we're using pulse waves, so I'm going to dial in the second oscillator at full volume and I'm just going to make it play an octave down. And I'll give you a sine wave. I might actually pitch it two octaves down just to give us a little bit of a bass element in the lead. And I'm going to introduce a third oscillator and I'm going to give it a fifth up. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add the fourth oscillator and I'm going to play with its pitch but rather than um, just making it pitch freely which will give us a kind of a bit of an atonal effect, I don't want that, I'm going to sync oscillator 3 and 4. That'll give us a bit more of a screaming effect. Now if I give it a couple of voices of unison. What I'll do is I'll use the step envelope. I'm going to um, turn the filter down and assign the step envelope to open that filter. Um, it's running in eighth notes here, so I'm going to dial in a double exponential, um, an exponential reverse into an exponential forward just to make something fairly straightforward. <laughs> And I can add in the delay if I like, I can sync it um, and I can put it on ping pong, put it on uh, on sixteenths or I can take the sync off and I can put the timing um, very very short on just 20 milliseconds for example, turn the feedback up, turn the low cut of the filter off and offset it about halfway. Just for a bit of a unique effect. If I turn the delay off, and now what I want to do is I want to use the step envelope as an arpeggiator or a sequencer. So if I turn the cutoff off and I assign it to note and I get a level wave select, you can see that as I move it up, it moves up in whole values. Um, so I'm going to start off on the root note. I might go a uh, minor third here. I might go a fifth here. I might just lengthen the whole step envelope to 16 steps. Uh, might go an octave up. Uh, might come back here to a minor. Um, go back up to a perfect fifth. I might go up to a, uh, a minor seventh. And I might end up at a perfect fourth. Um, so, okay, so if I play this now, yeah, filters down if I turn the filter up. Okay, so if I play it on sixteenths, I've got my little riff. Now I can do a couple of things. I could actually turn the cutoff down and make it open. Um, or I could just let this play with the uh, be the the sequencer if you like. Turn the cutoff up, and I can use LFO one to assign it to the um, volume, and use a pulse wave, um, sync it to sixteenths. <laughs> So I can play with all the different wave types. So just a cool couple of different avenues, I guess, to make some lead sounds using all the different parameters in Carbon Electra. Check it out at Plugin Boutique.